Here at Homework Express, it is our mission to solve any and every math problem at any place and at any time. We recently came across this phenomenon with ferrets and with math. This phenomenon is already mysterious because ferrets don't do math. This phenomenon is known as ferret math. So we came down to the Petco and Boardman to figure out what this is all about at Ferret Frenzy. Have you ever heard of anything called ferret math? No, I haven't. Well, ferret math is a phenomenon that you can't just own one ferret. Because once you get one, they mysteriously turn into two, then three, then four, till you can't even count anymore. You got that right. <laughs> Do you feel like you're a victim of the ferret math? Hmm, I guess. Not really. Do you feel like you might get another ferret in the future? Yes, I really will. I think that you're a victim. Have you ever heard of something called the ferret math? No. It's a phenomenon that you can't just have one ferret. That is true. We have two, but we are trying to get our grandmother to adopt another one here. And then after that, you feel like you're going to adopt a fourth? Yes. So what's your name? Nicole. And you work here at Petco? Yes, I'm the general manager. Have you experienced anyone, any visitors or customers at Petco with ferret math? Yes, now that you mention it, I actually have. Have you seen a lot of those customers back here today? Yes, it seems that, yes, you cannot just own one ferret. Well, ferret math is the phenomenon that you, can o you can't only have one ferret. They mysteriously multiply once you get one. That's true. That's very true because we got her and then we got the other one. And we just love them. We, you know, they're just, I, I would have millions. So would you say you're a victim of ferret math? Yes. A victim of ferret math. <laughs> you think you're going to be a victim the rest of your life? No, not really. No, not really. Do you feel like you're a victim of ferret math? <laughs> yeah. Do you see any ferrets in your future? Uh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> How many will you get till you stop? Uh, well, I'm at five right now, and I think five's good for now. Are you afraid of the ferret phenomenon? I, I actually am, yes. I think that one would be my max, and apparently that's not possible. So I don't really want to end up with five. You heard it. She doesn't want to be a victim. She's scared to be a victim of ferret math. While many ferret owners claim to be victims of this ferret math phenomenon, some are disproving this theory. Ferret math, fact or fiction? The world may never know.